pictures. In this video, I'm just going to show you how to create uh, really unusual custom shapes in a few seconds. So just obviously starting from a custom shape itself. Select the shape option up here and select the shape. Now, depends which shape you want to use, but obviously one from graphic extras or your own shapes or ones that come with Photoshop. Okay, once you've actually done that, now you just go down here, apply one shape, and then hold the shift key down. And this is a quick way of combining shapes. And of course you can actually create shapes that would probably be virtually impossible, or very tricky anyway, to create if you're just doing it on a point by point basis. Right, now you've actually done that. You've actually got the custom shape design. This is an entire vector now. But, next thing you want to do maybe is to define it actually as a custom shape. If you go to the custom shape, you'll notice you can't see it. actually select that. Well, just go down here, direct selection tool, and just select the entire set. And now go to edit, and now you can go define custom shape. And it will, at some point, because it's quite a complex vector design, come up with a little dialogue that says, give me a name for the custom shape. And there it is. Click OK at that point, and that's it. You've actually, if you go now, go to the custom shape tool, and you go to the, down the bottom here, it puts it right at the bottom, and you've got the custom shape that was created. Now you can use that in future projects. Hope you found that.